Rusa deer. I'm not a butcher, but I'm going to show you how to pull the primals out of um, out of a carcass. This is removal of the belly flap and the brisket. First cut is in there. Let's pull that flap around. Here's the line to just underneath the front leg. Go straight down. If you hit the ribs, glide over them. There it is. Same on the other side. Simple, cheap bunning saw. I'm going to cut all the ribs and get on an angle to get them hard to get ribs behind the shoulder. Following the knife mark. Again, on the other side. I'm going to drop the whole four quarter off. On a lamb we used to come up four ribs. Um, I'm going to come up five. It just makes it easier. So you come one, two, three, four, five. Put the knife through. Staying very square. Important to stay square. One, two, three, four, five. Five. Above it, square to the ground, straight through, and out. Bunning saw. Still square to the ground. Four quarter. This is the loin, rack of ribs. So we take it off. About three centimeters down from the bottom of his bum. You're looking for a joint in the backbone. There it is. Follow the, follow the joint to the very edge. Go through, staying square. It's a good, good tip. I'm a little high. In there's a rump bone. It stops about there. I've, I've, I've just I've hit it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go under it and out about that much. I missed by. It's not much. The rat, the loin, lots of different ways to do this next bit. This may be the easiest, it may not be. What we're going to do is, we're going to pull this one leg off the pelvis.
I'm looking for is the ball and socket joint. It's a ball and socket. There's a connector there. Cut it. Get in under it. Bone. Same again, except now we're going to cut the pelvis off the bone. It's a mirror image on this side. You've got a road map. So, Really looking for the ball and socket. I know it's in there, so I'm going after it now. There it is. Over it. But fill it, simple. That's it before trimming. This is the round stake, this is the silver side. There's a line. You see it, the rump is there. I'm going to take the rump off. S square. That's the rump, ready to be trimmed. You still on? Yep. Okay. The round, or the knuckle. You want to take the kneecap with the cut, so go high. Is that any better? Yeah. Find the kneecap. Seam on the outside of the leg. Inside, outside, the outside. That's the seam. Pick it. Open up right to the bone. This side's more harder. Got two seams. It's this one you want. This one will take you on a wild goose chase. Or there's the bottom of your ball. There's the top of your bone. Don't worry about the same. 
Find the bone, follow the bone all the way down. Clear the top. Little hole to put your finger in. Blade on the bone. Blade on the bone. The trick is to cross the cuts on the bone. The bone bark will come with it. Round steak, ready to be trimmed. Top side. Top side seems right there, straight off the tip of the bone. Um, the top side is under this. This is the cap. So, straight across. Pick the seam. You see? you see it hollow out, heading for the silver side. We don't want to accidentally take this muscle here. This, this, this is the major muscle. So once we've cracked the top, take it to the bone. From in here, take it, follow the seam right to the outside. It'll take you over to that seam there. I'm just going to follow it round. This is the silver side muscle. Follow it round. Gets a little tight down the bottom. Top side, ready to be trimmed. I'm going to take the silver side off. This is a part of the silver side without getting too tricky. If you've got an S hook, use one. I haven't. I'm going to change the position of the hook to the front muscle, just like that. It's pretty strong enough. I'm going to cut a hole through the side of this, pretty big enough for my finger. I'm going to cut it off at the top so there's a good handle. You can see a seam at the top here that runs in line with the shin bone. Straight around there. On the other side, same again. Straight around there. Follow it in under the muffle bone. Stay hard on the bone, hard on the bone. Gone. Silver side ready to be trimmed. This is the heel muscle. It starts at this fatty stuff. Trim to this muscle, take the whole heel muscle out, you'll have the silver side.